buy them. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Dash. I'm Dawn. And this is my YouTube channel it's called Dallas Flipping, where I show you the stuff I find at garage sales, flea, mar flea markets, thrift stores, in the trash, people that I rob at 7-Eleven at 2 a.m. You know, cool stuff. So um, today is Sunday, August the 8th of 2021, and this is a haul video, basically for the weekend, because we went out yesterday and didn't really find much. We went out today, didn't really find much, but here's what we got. Um, the first thing we got was an estate sale, which we were there like almost an hour early. I paid four dollars for a rubber band. I uh, got some really old license plates. I got um, sequential essential. Um, what does I say? Sequential. Sequential. Yeah, we'll go with that. Uh, February of 1990. It's a, it's a trailer plate. Another one. Oh, it's 100 years. Wow. Oh yeah, this is this is almost brand new. I'm gonna keep this. The original six-digit Texas plates. So now the Texas plates are seven digits. Um, after 2008, they went to seven digits, and then in 2012 they changed colors because they ran out of seven-digit plates. But this is an original six-digit plate. Uh, early. 90s to about 2002-4, I guess 8 when they changed it. So, yeah, really cool. The Lone Star State. Beautiful. We got some more, um, I'm not, they're regular license plates. I, oh yeah, that's, that's a, a farm truck plate. They smell like old people. Uh -huh. There's a plus Eight of a dollar. <laughs> um, that's what that was. That, that really is beautiful. For, I mean, an old license plate. Yeah. It's like a front plate they never put on the car. Something like that. Yeah. Um, we got these little pound puppy uh, vans from 1995. P-P-I-L-G-T. Whatever that means. Uh, Elizabeth. If you're watching, I need help with these. I don't know if you're Just put the tubs. That's so cool. It's a little van that opens up. There's no puppies with it, but I mean, it's pretty good condition. Yeah. It's a little play set. Nice to have a little Probably did. Probably did. Okay. It's really cute. Um, we got another one. Is it the same thing? Yeah. Ooh, multi pot. Yeah. It's just the exact same thing. Do ranch. <laughs> so that's those two. Um, we did go to game trade because I've been buying so many consoles and selling so many games. I realize I, I don't have a game to test Super Nintendo consoles if I buy another Super Nintendo console. So I got um, Nigel Manziel's World Championship race for five dollars. And today we got some stuff at a thrift store. It's a doodle bear. Oh, doodle bear. Doodle bear. Um, it's in really good condition. I don't know if it's even been written on. But then you just don't you want to watch. Yeah, exactly. That's what I'm saying. I don't know. I don't like mothballs. Um, we got a 2008 LFL um, Star Wars clone trooper ship. Uh, it appears to be complete. It doesn't have landing gears, but it does have this hidden gun. Oh, that's how you do it? I don't know. Um, oh, it's missing the missiles, I just noticed, up here on top. It opens, it's missing the droid and the figure. But, hey, for uh, $1.91, it'll, it'll profit me about 15, 20 bucks. Um, we got the armband. I can't remember this. So, so. The armband case for your video iPod. It's new in packaging. There's two cases, and it appears to be two... What do you call them? Arm, arm, armbands? Wristbands? It's like when you want to go jogging or, you know listen to your music in the shower. <laughs> I don't know. Um, this is a really cool one. I saw it sitting there and I had to get it. Uh, Lufthansa is an airline. Um, German airline. This is made in France. Oh, that's cool. France. Ingrid. Probably nice. Lufthansa. <laughs> um, yeah, really really nice dark color ashtray. Uh, there was only one like this sold about two or three months ago. And it was like 35 bucks plus shipping. No, it, was, it came from Germany. 
Um, we got Skylanders Giants for the Wii. I guess it's complete. It doesn't really have much. Um, not a very good game. Not a very well. The game is good fun, but uh, as far as money goes, it's what five dollars. But I have a bunch of Skylanders, so I'm just gonna bundle it together with some. Um, we got three copies of Rock Band. Two Rock Bands. One of them has a manual. That one's not it. The other one doesn't. And then I got Rock Band 2, also does not have a manual. 90 cents, you cannot go wrong for 90 cents. And that means we can get the guitars out of the garage and test them. So that's a, we got a fun filled day ahead of us. Um, that's really it, nothing super special this weekend. Sales were, garage not sales happening. were bad. Sales are good, the, 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 so. sales are good. But um, yeah, it's, it's just terrible. Like there's none and then the ones that there are, it's just, crap uh we did find one that had an atari 2600 or something like that but we couldn't ever find the sale it was like a walker's chase yeah that's exactly what it was a boondoggle that wanted to toggle so that's really it um we're wrapping it up so uh wherever you are in the world remember not every day can be a good day not every day can be a, a goodbye day you have to have the bad days to make the good days even better it's part of life you live you die you pay taxes and then when you're dead you still pay more taxes so, from everyone here at Dallas Slippin, what? I said, what a life. What a life. <laughs> everyone here at Dallas Slippin wishes you a wonderful Sunday afternoon, and we'll see you next time.